Okay. When sprayed onto an object, it makes it virtually indestructible. Come on in, Dennis Weiss, president of Line X, to explain this all to us. Uh, it sounds too good to be true. You know, it, it really is a fantastic product with lots and lots of applications. And, uh, you know, we have had some fun demonstrating that this morning on the plaza. Yeah, I, so give us the genesis. How did it start? How long has it been around? And because how come I haven't heard of this? I'd like to spray myself a few times <laughs> before getting on a New York City subway. You know, we've been uh, around, Linux has been around for 23 years. And uh, the product has really benefited the last few years from just the... Uh, Again, the increase in the automotive industry, we got our start spraying uh, bed liners and pickup trucks uh, coming out of the financial crisis of 08. You know, the car business has come back in a big way. And uh, now the, the product has just uh, become increasingly more accepted. So we've had uh, more opportunities to showcase it. So is this one of these things then where consumers started to see it and they wanted it? You know, in other words, it sounds like you have that industrial demand from the automakers. But now, are you starting to see consumers wanting to buy this stuff and use it in different, different applications? We are. We're, we're seeing, uh, in addition to the automotive demand, we're seeing uh, commercial and industrial customers from other industries saying, hey, there's an application here as well. Um, but, you know, they, look, they see the trucks driving around, see how durable the product is, and say, hey, you know what, we'd like that as well. All right, well, you know, we got to put you to the test, Dennis. So. All righty. <laughs> we got one of our reporters, Lauren Simonetti. She's outside right now. She's got a baseball bat. Uh, you're telling me that she <laughs> won't be able to damage this car. Well, uh, look, look at first. that. Is that, what, a cup. Is that a paper cup? That yeah. is a solo cup, uh, and she crushed Whoa. the one without the product, and she's standing on the one with the product. Holy like she's done it before. Lauren. Oh, and by the way, great balance, too. Yeah, I was going to say, very <laughs> uh, impressive. Lauren. Does she hear us? <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to uh, uh, eggs. Oh, uh -oh. Eggs. That was a regular. That egg. was the regular egg, the non-coated oh, one. <laughs> and here's the one with coating on just it. Just bounced away. I just went down the fifth <laughs> avenue, sixth avenue. Wow. <laughs> now what Whoa. is this? Light, Light bulbs. Light bulbs. I'm afraid to throw oh, this one. Yep. Smash. Anarchist. <laughs> <laughs> You know, and these are just great, fun little Amazing. experiments to demonstrate the strength of the product. Maybe you could sell it to the presidential candidates. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Wow. They could have used that in Seattle. <laughs> yeah, but, so I, it's 23 years. I, I can't believe I'd never heard of it. It's, it does feel like there's so many applications, even yeah. around the house, that you can use something like this. There are. We, uh, we are starting to see this product emerge more in construction. Uh, there are marine applications. Um, a number of our uh, partners that we have in the manufacturing world have put it on uh, our RTVs and UTVs and, uh, you know, so there really are a ton of applications. Well, you know, uh, there's a lot of also, I mean, okay, impressed with the Solo Cup, impressed with the light bulb, but we heard it could do even more than that. So, tell you what we want to do. We want it, we got a Jeep outside. It's covered with the stuff. Yep. Uh, when we come back, we're going to put it to a real test. Sounds good. Ready great. for it, Dennis? I am ready. A real test. All right. All right. Is she we'll doing? be right back. <laughs> Driving into a building? <laughs> <laughs> Oops. <laughs> but Dennis Weiss, Line X president. This company makes a spray that it claims makes items indestructible. And I want our viewers to see Lauren Simonetti outside <laughs> as she's about to hit oh, boy. someone That's a wearing a sight. Charles, as oh. hard as I can. I'm hitting that bumper. <laughs> that my hand oh. turns something back I hope that from the vibration. Come there. It's gonna and hurt now, itself. yeah, that's right. We're gonna have Mike drive over the line X treated solo cups. Let's go, Mike. And the clay pigeon. Oh, I don't know. Goodness. Wow, look at that. And wait, if you can come out on the other side, you can yeah, see. Yeah, something crunched. Something crunched. They're totally oh in good my shape. God. <laughs> <laughs> the tires crunched. <laughs> It's pretty amazing. Hey, Lauren, I was told you were going to hit someone wearing an armored suit. Did, did, did Isn't there someone I can hit? Why don't you come out here, Charles? I'll gear you up, and I'll, I'll hit you. Another now, thing we can do here. The Jeep itself, is the whole Jeep, is the Jeep all lined with this or just uh, certain parts? The Jeep. And if someone gives me a key, we can do what we used to do in high school, Charles. Oh, boy. Wow. Okay, anybody have a key? Here we go. Here we go. All right. Now, New York is really neat, this protection. <laughs> they do. Yes. Look at that, that haters. Look at that. Haters, haters are going to hate, but not with that product. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Wow. I'm putting elbow grease in there, too. <laughs>
<laughs> All right, so uh, let, let's get down to, to brass tacks on. The, 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 we were talking, uh, you know, in the break. It's not available for consumers, so if I wanted to buy a can of this and, and go around the house spraying everything, I can't. No, you sure can't. You'd have to go out and visit uh, some of our franchisees. So we have a network in North America of about 485 uh, franchisees that would love to treat your vehicle with uh, this product. You take your pickup truck, how much would it cost? If, let's just say, a, a, you know, a regular size pickup, a F-150. Yeah, if you get an F-150, you know, the, the bed size will matter, but it's going to be roughly about $500. Uh, and what that does is two things, really. It, it enhances the value of your vehicle. It provides an incredible aesthetic, but more importantly, it is durable. The guys that are in trades that are, you know, throwing shovels and equipment into the back of these things, it really holds up under their wear and tear. How's business been? Uh, business has been great, actually. We, uh, in the North America, you know, we've uh, really benefited from the uptick in uh, Detroit. So, uh, you know, we're getting our fair also, share of the trucks. Also, the truck business is outrageous. I trucks mean, are very yeah. popular right now. <laughs> and, uh, you know, it's a couple of things, I'm sure. It's, you know, uh, low gas prices. Uh, the vehicles have become incredibly lifestyle choices, I think. So, uh, yeah, we're really benefiting from that. Do you find that even people who don't need the trucks for, you know, for work, uh, they're still coming in because the longevity? 500 sounds like a reasonable investment if I'm going to buy a pickup truck to line it, to line it with this. Yeah, absolutely. If you think that the average truck today is going to be about 45000 all in, adding another 500 bucks is very reasonable. Uh, but, yeah, we see a lot of people bringing it in just to enhance the value of their vehicle that aren't in the trades. I teased on Twitter that, and Emac gave me the idea, maybe we could call this Trump spray because it's indestructible. <laughs> does it come in any color besides black, like orange? It does. We, we are <laughs> able to, to color match, and I'm not going to touch that orange comment. <laughs> <laughs> but it comes in different colors. It, it sure of colors. does, absolutely. You know, this is a beautiful thing. It's a, it's a great American company, 23 years old. You guys started from scratch. Sure. You've been building it and building it. And this is the kind of things that don't get promoted often enough. Have you found any sort of regulatory hurdles? Because I worry it's a spray. It's the kind of thing that this administration says, oh, oh you know, what's going on? Is, uh, have you run into any kind of obstacles so far? We've run into a few hurdles uh, in different you know, municipalities. Uh, but this product is 100% solid, so no VOCs, so good for the environment. Um, so we, we have had challenges, but usually we can overcome those with education. Right. Dennis, congratulations. Great stuff. Thank you so very much.